Welcome back to Nordlandia, our banished town. I was sitting here and thinking to myself, oh, I should let these other things render and just take care of it. Well, actually, I just freed up some space on my hard drive. And I'm like, you know what? The people of Nordlandia need us. They are hardworking, lovable, but stupid. And they need us to help them out. So, let's get to it. Let's get to it. We're in autumn. They are they're harvesting crops. Yay, good job for you. Got a lot of farmers. Nobody's left in the boarding house. We seem to be maxed out for iron tools. Alright, that's fine. Um, hit our limit for firewood. That's also just fine. And I'm super tempted to build a second trading post to get things rolling. Let's see. What's their limit? Uh, you know what? You can beef that up a little bit. Oh, there's a trader right now. Who are you? Resource merchant. This is perfect. I'm not going to buy iron because we've got plenty, plenty, plenty. But we will buy these logs. This is exactly what we wanted. Buy logs at a value of two. Sell the firewood at four. And it makes more firewood. So it's just an awesome deal. Really. Um, how much is this going to take? Yeah, not even that much. Okay, a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're just gonna click until it happens. Hey, 200! Math! Go stay in school, kids. So, iron, perfect. We don't need that. Titch, wait, orders, orders. Ooh. Yeah, coal, leather, logs, iron and stone, every visit. Perfect. Trade, thank you. Do whatever you want, my friend. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. So we increased what we wanted here, but not necessarily the limit for woodcutters. We have four woodcutters. And in a town this size, four woodcutters is not a bad idea. And I've done it again, and I haven't turned off the effects. And it's just hard to see. It's freaking awesome, but it's just hard to see when you render and when you're watching videos. So don't get mad. I know some of you will. I'll hear it from a handful and they'll be like, just leave it! It's awesome! It is awesome. You are correct. Alright, so let's look and see what our production levels are. We are producing just enough food. Not the best situation to be in because I want to expand and move forward. And we've been doing a little down-down and we're, we're working our way up. We've got quite a bit of food. Um, our economy with the firewood is rolling along, which is great. And really, our, our Hide coats are doing good too. We're, we're doing hide, right? Because we don't have enough wool. Wait, there's a hundred wool. Forty-three leather. Some of you making warm coats? Yeah, warm coats. Hide. All right, so we're splitting it. That's um, that's not a bad idea. Do we have any of them coming here? Yeah, hide coats are coming here, which is probably fine. We'll leave the warm coats to our population. Now I remember. I remember. Okay. Perfect. We've got students that are working their way through school. Happy day. And we allocated them to, to take all this stuff out. So this is our new suburb, right? We're making just enough food to get by. This will just take time to grow. This is really helping. This might make the difference, to be honest with you. Um, but I think for now, what we should do quite a few laborers. Let's go ahead and build a couple houses. Let's get some more people in here, dang it. There we go. Two more houses, and then we will set people to clear some, some area, right? So, clear this. Um, all of this is high priority. Why not? Somebody died of old age. A laborer. Nobody replaced him. What an enigmatic death. Ignomatic? Ignomatic? Anyway, I don't know how to say that word. I like it too. But every now and then I get it just right. It's a fun word, it means, uh. It means it's like nothing. It means your death was just blah. Basically, in layman's terms, I suppose. In layman's terms, I can't even pronounce it. In layman's terms, you're an idiot, sir. Well, we've got more wood, so let's go ahead and increase our limit to 600. Use our woodcutters to just 
get our trading power up quite a bit. We're holding 600 firewood here. I think that's a number that we can increase. Let's get herbs up to 200. We'll leave the hide coats alone. I think the main bulk of our economy is probably going to be firewood. So we'll let the firewood catch up. Once it's maxed, we'll beef that up another 100 or so. Alright, so you've got 70% full. You are 70% full. What do you have here? Taylor? Yeah, whatever. 17. So we're, we're pulling the weight off of these storage barns, which is good because the marketplaces are better. Okay, wow. A vendor died of old age. Someone replaced him. Laborer died. Oh, the farmer died during childbirth. That's sad. Sad day. Sad day in Alright, so what we were going to do, and it is actually probably way too late to be doing this, but... Let's see, how many spots is that? Three, let's see, one, two, three, one, two, three, and an extra for good measure, right? Whoa, whoa, which way am I going? Fifteen by fifteen. I've set this up really strangely. Oh, well. Remove this stuff. Let's go check out Nomads. We did want to expand. How many? 15? You know, we have a physician. Whatever, let's do it. Let's just go for it. We have a boarding house. Look at that, they all fit there. Nice. So it must fit 15. It must fit 15 here. Let's see. Do a road off of that. Ah, oh, I counted it wrong. Totally counted it wrong. Um, blah. Let's let's do two stone building out so that I can do that properly, and then we will set up a, a crop field ready for next season. And I really don't like the way that is set up. So let's let's do this right. We got a road here. Do a road behind the houses. We'll do some other stuff. Now, like, we can do a tailor and some other things here. But, uh, let's make sure we're not messing with the road. We'll just do a 15 by 15. We'll let them clear that out. I really honestly think that we're doing okay with food because these two are going to really beat us up. We could do a fishing spot right here and one right up here. And we we'll get some really good coverage from that. So, I think, I think we're still okay. We did just bring in nomads, and we produced a crap load more than we needed last year. But as you can see, um, you know they they pulled they pulled some food. They gotta eat. Ah, okay. Fuel limit has been reached. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna just bump this up by 200, actually. Let's just go ahead and do that. We'll keep the woodcutters nice and busy. Cause why not? Got quite a few extra laborers because of the nomads. Do we have any open areas? I mean, we could have another herbalist, but... Man, let's do vendors. I want goods to be moved pretty quickly. So yeah, so it's early autumn, but uh, let's do pumpkins. I don't think we have a lot of pumpkins. We've got a couple up there, actually. So let's do cabbage. Do cabbage, assign a couple of farmers, which will then turn into laborers. So let's... Oh, man! Is it rare? Riley or you? Yeah, our name uh, died during childbirth. Not, not cool. That makes me sad. All right, let's see. Is there anything to remove that these laborers could be working on? Hmm. I don't want to send them on like a, a long walk, get them killed or. How close are we? I don't know. There's there's roads out here. They can, they can handle this. Let's get some more stone, a little bit more iron because we haven't been buying it. And let's let's check the trading post. Uh, we took so long that that little icon's not there anymore. All right, what do you have, my friend? You are the, this guy's freaking perfect. Okay, orders. Good. Okay, good. You're coming through. With all right, logs. We always buy the logs, the logs. 
which I hope, almost at the limit, like 2,000 or more, at least. Um, coal, oh my goodness. Let's just see what we can buy. We need all the coal. Yeah, but 200. All right, so that was only 800 to do this. Leather, I think we're doing okay on. Yeah, well, you know what, we're fine on leather because we've got the cattle. Um, so for this time, I don't want to do that. I want to buy as much coal as we possibly can. Yeah, you see how much that is? And I still want to buy the logs because that's really our source of income. So 1,000. Ah, come on. Should I drop this at 200? I did not do much. You know what, let's keep that at 400. They're cheap. And it's really worth it. So let's do 800. Let's see if that drops us to... Good night! Coal is expensive. 600. I mean, 600 is quite a bit. Okay. Um, let's move the herbs around. Oh, they're going to do the same thing. Overpay by 60? Come on, I don't want to overpay by 60. Yikes. Um, 190? Overpay by 20? There we go. 620 coal, 400 logs. That is a trade worth doing. Oh my goodness, that's awesome. Let's see, let's get a couple more traders. Let's just max this out. If this is going to be our big trade hub, we, we need to make sure we're good to go. Let's keep this at speed 10. Keep slowing it down. Those are some good trades there. Look, maxed, max, max. Really maxed, oh my goodness. And this one is max as well. We could beef that up. So a couple of people are dying, they're getting replaced. Um, four of twelve. How are we doing on food? Eleven thousand. It's jumped up. So we should be producing far more still than what we need. So in the last ten years we have still produced more. So we haven't really had any big scares, I think. I got a little freaked out with the uh, disease. Oh, there's another one. You. What do you have? What is this? Educated? No, he is playing. Get yourself to a doctor. What are you doing? Oh, that's a really long walk. Why are they going that way? Oh, I guess this isn't really covered. Um, that's a pretty bad idea. I'm going to stop that right now. Just just cancel. Cancel the pickup at Red Home. Yeah, yellow fever. There it is. There it is. Yeah, I feel bad about that. I thought they could just walk over this part, but they can't. So, that's not good. So, we're producing more than we need. Um, we should probably make some more homes, because we've got... Oh, we've still got people over there. I don't like people being in the boarding house. They can't really... See, he died of starvation. Dang it. They can't really... Um, picking up resources. Why are you picking up resources? I said... I said cancel... Cancel removals. What do you... Cancel! You know what, die out there. Whatever. You're infected. Visiting the dock now, you're like, Okay, I'm going to visit the doctor. 600 limit. 700. Everybody is dying. Frozen. Oh, gosh. My bad. That was... That was me. That was me. Brick. Ah, uh, that's stupid. I should have done that. Like I was saying, I wanted people to have homes so they can have the babies. Cause strange, people aren't terribly comfortable having babies in a boarding house. Weird. I mean, some people might be, but, uh, you know, not this group. We're at max, 150 for clothes. 250. Let's just bring that up. Keep producing more, more goods. Starvation, starvation, frozen. <laughs> oh boy. 
not my finest hour. Jeez. I can't believe I did that. I feel really stupid now. I'd let those people die. <sighs> it's because I don't have homes. Like, this makes people kind of cold just going like this. So really, I should pop a couple homes right here. Because nobody, you know, is working in the middle. And it kind of sucks. That's four houses. That's quite a bit of growth now that I think about it. But you know what? That's just what we're going to do. 700. Keep going. 800. And I'll do 800 and make sure this is at least at 1,000. There we go. 1,000. So we'll have quite a bit to actually trade. Which is good. Okay, blacksmith, iron tools. You know what? Can we just do steel? Just make steel tools. Uh, where's the other blacksmith? You're over here, aren't you? Yeah, you know what? I got that coal for steel. I did not get that coal just to heat your white house. Hopefully we get some more coal and I can buy it. That's what the uh, extra wood is for. So, iron tools. Let's get 40 of those off the market, basically. And we'll just increase the limit right now. So it says 800, but have I pulled all of the... Um, yeah, desired 1,000. I don't have any. What are my guys doing? I'm getting are you getting hers, girl? Don't want them that bad. Oh my gosh. I have I haven't maxed out. Like you have six guys working for you. Oh my goodness. Okay, one twenty five. I'm sitting here cranking this up thinking, man, we're busting this out. It's really we set we've got like twelve hundred logs. Let's check our limit real quick. Logs, two thousand. People are becoming laborers, that's great. Three thousand for that. Do we need to worry about any of this other stuff right now? I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah. Oh see the coal hadn't even been distributed yet. Yeah, it was still sitting in here. Alright, that's good. That's really good. Oh boy, I am going to steal every last bit. Every last bit of the firewood. <laughs> oh, we should probably chop a bit more wood. See, I've got quite a few logs right there. <laughs> alright, alright. I'm not doing a stupid graveyard right here. I like the use of space here, though. Oh, this works. There we go. Let's just build a woodcutter. Someone died of old age, a farmer, and they were replaced. I like it when they're replaced. That's that's good. Let's put a couple people right there into the vendor slot. These are getting finished up. I want everybody to have a place to place to live. Do some more of that. Coal, my goodness. Look, look how interesting that looks. Up close it looks even better, but it looks like uh, black fur or feathers. Like piles of them right there. It's kind of <laughs> interesting. Alright, so we're getting some people dying off. Uh, the cemetery... Oh, it's apparently not so full anymore. We have a zombie problem. Somebody kicked down a grave and they don't really care. Not sure. I wonder, historically, what happened. Didn't that occur, you know? I and mean, I know people built over grave sites eventually because they lost track of who's who's who and what's what. I'm running low on stone. I'm running low on quite a few things. So I have 800 firewood in stock right now and some hide coats. Even some iron tools. Um, logs. We want to keep this good trend going, right? So that's cheap. Coal, we can afford 300, right? Let's see, 800. Yeah, we're still doing good. We're still doing way good. Let's see what 40 tools will get us. Just All right, that adds a little bit to it. Um, 400 stone. Good on iron for now. So maybe what I'll do is do 200 here and 200 here. I need a bit more to work with. So let's do 70. Still need more. Okay. Um, 
iron. That's, we're getting there. really want some of that stone, though. But I'm not giving up the logs or the coal, but uh, let's just see what 150 will bring us to. So I'm overpaying now, so let's just crank this up to 180, overpaying by 30. Let's trade an additional 10. You know what? Whatever. Here, there's 30, buddy. Don't spend it all in one place. good. Speed it back up. And add another woodcutter, because we've got a limit to reach. 800, and we're only at 600. And all of it is gone here. <laughs> so, as you can see, cutting wood can be a viable, you know, a viable industry. So we're still only at four. Um, should I split the herd? How are we doing with the food now that... Now that, uh, yeah, we're cutting a little bit more even now. But this isn't accounted in yet, this this uh, cabbage field. So we'll, let's just see what that does. I don't want to panic and go too heavily overboard because I really don't have a ton of room. Oh, man, look at all these fields that are not... I wonder how I fix that, right? I mean, I guess it's storing it here. So the storage space is not that far away. But... Uh, yeah, see, look, it, they're taking it directly, directly here. Oh no, somebody was crushed by a rock. Dang it. Filled right back up. Gravesite McGee. You know, let's take a look and make sure everybody's not going all over the place. Alright, so you're, you're all working really close. Except for you. Alright. That's kind of a problem. These guys are going to be a little far away, right? Well, there's not too many of them. That's that's really good spread. Um, that's not great. That one guy. So, let's build another house right over here. Which I didn't bother to check this guy now that I think about it. What are you doing? Or did I? Either way, not bad. Not bad. So, let's check our inventory. If we're still requesting the 80, maybe we're still dishing out some stuff. Let's see. No? They're probably just just finished. Look at wheelbarrows. Oh, they've got so much stuff. Come on, update. Yeah, they're pulling some firewood. Nice. Nice. Okay. Well, that's fine. That's fine. You guys just keep rocking and rolling. We've got plenty of wood right now. Um, that stockpile is very full. So are these. So let's make another one right behind it, probably. I should probably just use these for stockpiles, shouldn't I? This, this little strip of land, I, I suppose. That's probably what's going to be serving it best, so... Alright, has everybody got jobs here? I'm not using... Are these full? Oh my gosh, okay, I freaked out. There's, just for a second, I was like, what? How are you full? Five! Alright, good, you're at least growing. So let's see if the cabbage was taken into account here. It was. So we're actually a little ahead. Just a little ahead. Um, these will really help once they get through. So it's either be patient or, you know, build up another part of the industry with fishing or something like that. I, I don't really know what the answer is, but we can just make a decision and go with it. Um, that herd down there, I wonder. Let's see. You're producing a good amount of beef. For some reason, you're producing more, so I don't really want to mess with you. Now, there's a lot of chickens, and these guys grow fast, so let's do that. Let's get some chickens going on down south, because delicious eggs and all that good stuff. Come on. Who doesn't like some good old chicken? A chicken! We're going to do a big one. Big one. Get that pasture going. I think this is like the only thing going on right now. So, we've got plenty of laborers and builders to take care of this. Probably going to just come in droves. Look at, them, look at them all filing down here. Hey, I got this! Hey. Forester died of old age, but they were replaced by a laborer. Fantastic. Not that they died is fantastic, but that they were replaced. So, yeah, looking good. Um, Taylor, warm coats. 
We've got wool. Are we low on leather? Inventory. Yes, actually. We are kind of low on leather. Let's drop the limit back down to 150. Kind of let him ease off. We sold some of it and had to replace it. And all that business. We've got the two allocated builders. So hopefully once it's removed, but plop those logs down there with the chickens right here. So there's five. Okay, trader. What do you have for us today? Lots and lots and lots of food, and I don't have any orders for them. Um, inventory. All right, we've gotten we've got the firewood we want, and food is cheap. We should just get some. Get some. Yeah, let's get like uh, two thousand corn. Just to feel good and have a nice buffer. And how much how much wood is that gonna cost us, right? Like Nope. Um six hundred. Overpaying. Underpaying. Um nineteen eighty. Let's just do that. Nineteen eighty. Make it even. That's fine. Our wood chopping industry is doing fantastic. And a little extra corn. I mean, extra food is not going to be a bad thing. And we've got the room. We've got storage right there. We've got storage right here. We have storage here, actually. So getting an influx of food is going to be good. It's it's better safe than sorry at this point. So it's going to start moving things around. Getting the, the excess wood. Wherever it is. Let's see. Those are logs, I think. Yeah, there's firewood mixed in here. Ones that are kind of colored differently because they've been chapped. So students, adults becoming laborers, children being born. Uh, what's our overall population? Let's see. 176. That's not bad. That is not bad. We didn't build any houses here because we're focused on over here. Oh wait, chickens. Chicken. Herdsmen. <laughs> takes two people to handle 66 chickens. You know what? And that's probably pretty accurate. But it takes more than that, to be honest with you. So where's our biggest chicken field? Let's see, 28, 28, they're the same, split it. So 16, those will grow pretty darn fast. You know, and that's probably good that we got that extra influx of food since these won't be here. We'll still be getting the eggs, but we won't get, we will not be getting the chicken meat. Chicken meat. Yeah. Is that our first chicken? No, that's our that's our worker. He's just doing his job. Sixty-six. We can do sixty-six. My goodness. So does this mean okay, controls number of animals to keep the pasture exceeding this count or result in livestock being slaughtered for food? I guess in bad times we could just you could just pull this bar down, right? And say, Hey, we need food now. We don't need to worry about growth. Uh, people are going to die, so let's do this. Look at how much food we have. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. So, at this point, oh, they just need a market over here, right? Let me get rid of this field and do a market right here. Let's do that right now. Um, I'll put in another field over here. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Let's, let's clear out... Move all resources right there. And then we're going to do a crop. 15 by 15. Why was that not okay? Oh, we're like placing it on top of the building. Oh, you know what? We might want to give some room. So, one, two, three, four. Let's just do five. Be safe. There we go. We'll do a crop field right there. Let's get rid of this other crop field. Right here, I think. And even if it doesn't fit, we can just put it right back. It's already cleared. So, food. Not trade. Marketplace. Oh, dang it. Um, and it won't fit because of this little section. So, actually, let's just remove structure road and 
Why are people with question marks? Oh, extra farmers. Well, whatever, you'll be fine. Calm down. Let's do a market. Let's do it as far down as we can. Oh, it'd be nice to get rid of this stuff, actually. Let's get rid of these structures right there. Everybody move that crap. Let's go. We've got other stockpiles that we can use. Market. We're gonna go right there once that stuff's gone. Build it. Now let's put some... I don't want to get ahead because it's late winter. Let's see. Let's do a crop field right here. How far over can we go? 15. Good. 15 by 15. So we still need to add a little bit more now that I'm thinking about it. So. That's a tiny little crop field. Am I burning myself on this a little bit? Let's see. What are we doing here? Wheat. Um, let's do pumpkin. And wheat. I guess we are burning ourselves a little. Look, we're still over by three people. Um. Oh, right. You know, let's let's just be safe and do wheat. Yeah, we're not burning ourselves. Perfect. Let's hit play. It along. Look how many logs we've gone through. Oh my gosh. Uh, and you're at capacity. Fantastic. Here we go. 800 limit. Let's keep that around. 600. Well, I'll just pull these right now. Did I get it? Okay. 1,000 is a really good number to be at, I think. I like round numbers, though. So, Okay, so people are working the fields like they should be. That's great. We've got 20 extra laborers. Get some more vendors here because once this is finished, it's gonna be kind of crazy. Give all the builders that we can. So you've already hit your limit, huh? That's fine. Stay there, actually, because we need another influx of logs. We still have, you know, 12 foresters working around the clock, but still. All right. A couple more in there, and I think that'll do it for this video. It's already filling in with, with uh, goods. Man, let's do, uh, let's do a road. Oh man, what did I do? <laughs> uh, let's see, is there is there not a road possible? Oh, come on, come on. No? Piece of garbage. Whatever. Whatever, we'll just do another one there and another one here. That made such a weird makeshift thing. All right. What do you have real quick? Sheep. I want sheep. Um, I will build a pasture for sheep, for said sheep. I will gladly do this thing. And we will have sheep. Quite a bit of sheep, too. Okay, there's a pasture for them. I want to see if I can buy all of them before we before we head off. So, 16. How much is that going to cost me? Quite a bit. Not one sixteen. Sixteen. <laughs> Not happening. All right, you know what? We'll come back and do this later. I think uh, my computer's being a little funny. So let's just pause it, and when we come back, we'll figure out the sheep situation. Thanks for joining, and we'll talk to you later.